Yo, what's going on, guys? We're back with another episode of WWE 2K24, My Rise Undisputed. In the last episode, we got to fight three different... Yeah, we had three different matches. We got to fight Dirty Dom in the first match, Kevin Owens in the second match, and we de defeated the Monster Among Men, Braun Strowman. And now we're just one match away from the Undisputed Championship match, I believe. And I believe we have to fight... Here he is right here, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. I don't know, wait, is this, wait, is this, wait, no, this match is for the title. Yeah, so Cody Rhodes is the last person I gotta just go, I have to get through in order to be a champion. This is, this, like I said in the last episode, this is my story, not Cody Rhodes' story. Cody Rhodes has his shot in a whole other universe, okay? <laughs> in the real life universe. This is on a video game. This is, this is about me. Not you, Cody. So, you know, I got to... It's my time to shine. This is my story to, to uh, complete. Or to write, because we're still in the beginning of, of the whole series anyway. But uh, let's go see. Talk to, we got Cody Rose right here. Let's go talk to him. Who else we got over here? William Regal. All right, we're going to talk to American Nightmare first to see what's up. Cody, man, I was going to give you a call, but figured we should talk in person. I don't blame you. I know you and Reigns weren't in on it together. He was trying to hurt me, not help you. I appreciate that. At the same time, we both know I had you beat when Reigns attacked me from behind. Is that what we know? One, two, three, four, five. And that's when I got up to check on the ref. I don't need the recap. I was there. And I have the championship to prove it. You took the crossroads. It was over. Look, you hung tough. Your time will come. But last night, you were done. It was a strategy. I knew the ref was down. Why would I waste my energy kicking out? Okay, sure. Right, pal. Seriously. While you were counting in your head, I was just chilling. Taking a break. You know, some me time. Well, I hope you saved up plenty of energy while you were looking up at the lights, because you're gonna need it tonight. See you out there. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Did I record that part? Didn't I record that part? No, I don't record that part being the last episode. So wait, I did fight Cody Rose already. Yeah, we fought for the title already. Roman Reigns came and sabotaged the match for Cody. I ended up winning the championship. But I only got it for now because I know for a fact I'm not going to have this title for very much longer. Probably by tonight I'm going to lose it or next following week. Because this is all a part of Roman Reigns' plan. Some plan he has. A plan for him vacating the title just to win it back. I don't know. Did I have that on recording though? I don't... I don't think so. I, I, I honestly don't remember. It's been 10 days since the last episode was uploaded. I might have to go back and look at that. But hey, we got William Regal here. What's going on with Mr. Regal? It is an absolute crime the position that Roman Reigns has put you in. The cloud now hanging over your reign as WWE Universal Champion belies your effort. I know you fought like hell to win the title. You're damn right I did. I had to compete in an extra match too, and I still made it to the final and won. A fine achievement that the WWE Universe nonetheless looks askance at. Unfortunately, Reigns beat Cody as much as you did. Perhaps more. Seriously? What does it even matter how it happened? I walked away with the title, yet he's the one you want to be champion? Hogwash. I want the best man to win, and that is all. Really? No little push for your buddy's kid to go to the top? That accusation is beneath your dignity. Now, if you'll excuse me, it's a very busy night with the draft starting. Good luck. Oh, 
All right, well, let's just get on with the match then. I don't know where this is about to go. All right, Cody. Your no shenanigans about to happen. It is not my plan. This has nothing to do with me. This is Roman Reigns just trying to sabotage your story once again. This has nothing to do with me. So let's just have a clean fight. I hope so I can prove myself that I didn't need I did not need Roman Reigns to help me win that match. I I hope this uh this ring announcer glitch is fixed. Let's let me listen to it. But the champion did win the tournament and has another opportunity to prove himself tonight. Can the Dark Horse take down the American Nightmare one more time? Okay, so he didn't even say anything. He didn't even say nothing. He didn't even, he even announce who I am. I'm your undisputed champion, mother. Okay, bro. He didn't even say, he he wasn't even in the ring. Oh, that's right. I forgot the title match. He's gonna he's gonna announce me like this way. I forgot. <laughs> I told you this I I forgot this is a title match. He's gonna introduce me in the while we're already in the ring. <laughs> I'm the champion and Cody Rose is the challenger. Oh, they got, oh, they got, the, they got that, um, black, um, that black um, woman ref in the game. Oh, that's what's up. I didn't know she was in the game. Right, let's, let's get this started. Oh. Mean ass DDT from Cody Rhodes. What does that objective say? Russian leg sweep. Execute a grab on Cody Rhodes. All right. Sorry to ruin his lordship's plan, but Raw's Royal General Manager William Regal seems to have forgotten something. What is Miz talking about? Unsanctioned? Regal forgot that I had the first pick in the draft, 
So this conspiracy to steal the undisputed WWE Universal Championship for Raw ends tonight. He's not going to do this in the middle of his huge match, is he? The WWE Universal Champion has been drafted to SmackDown. Effective immediately. Miz can't do this. He just did, Saxton, and it's brilliant. Come on. Get out of the ring and grab your bag. It's time to go to your new home. Cheer up, Rhodes. I'm sure Regal will give you another chance at the World Heavyweight Championship. Regal doesn't look happy. Speak of the devil. Have a look, Regal. All the I's are dotted and all the T's are crossed. That's what I thought. Now tell my WWE Universal Champion to get out of that ring and pack his bags. I'm afraid Mr. Mazanin is correct. This rematch is canceled. And the undisputed WWE Universal Champion is bound for SmackDown. A huge change in the geography of WWE has just taken place in the middle of this championship match. Good luck countering that move in the draft, Regal. Miz just told the whole Raw audience, you want excitement, you come to SmackDown. While a huge question mark continues to hang over the Dark Horse champion. Bro, what? How are you going to do this in the middle of a match? I got traded during the middle of a match. That's just like an NBA player getting traded mid-game, middle of the game. And then send him out on the bench and send him back to the locker room. Oh my gosh. What is going on? Without Regal and Reigns, this guy would be working at the concession stand. That's more than an exaggeration, Corey. He put on a show at SummerSlam, and I, for one, think SmackDown got a steal in the draft. Yeah, we'll see. Dude, they have the same animation. That's the same animation from WWE 2K22 when you went to different brands, bro. <laughs> Alright, so we got some of that. So we got some new gear and a SummerSlam My Riser. Okay. Mike Mizian, what, 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 what is the meaning of this, man? Oh, wait, I got my upgrade points. Let me upgrade real quick. Uh, Give me a second. Um... We have 78 overall, right? 12 points left. Uh, yeah, I can, I can, I'm fine with that right now. I'm fine with that. Yep. Okay. All right. 70, what was that? 78? 79, I think. Yeah, all right. <laughs> all right. Miz, what the hell? Come on. How are you going to train me in the middle of the, bro? Good to see you too, champ. Come on, what's with the boo-boo face when I'm the one who liberated you from his lordship? I didn't need liberating. But let's skip the pleasantries. You wanted the WWE Universal Champion on SmackDown. Here I am. What I wanted is the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The champion can be anyone who understands what it means to represent the most must-see sports entertainment show on Earth. You think you're that guy? What I think is that I'm my own man, and the WWE Universe will come along with me or they won't. I'm not doing dog and pony shows for anyone. You might be your own man, but you are playing in my sandbox, and you can play big, bad, counterfeit, stone cold all you want, but you will quickly realize you're just making your life harder. I've never been one for the easy way. Good. That's the perfect attitude for your very first SmackDown main event. Since you were so ready to face Cody Rhodes on Raw, I can only assume you are ready for Kevin Owens tonight.
I beat KO in the tournament, and I will gladly beat him again. Excellent! And just a heads up, I might come see your match in person. You know, just an impartial observer to get a closer look at the champion I drafted. Absolutely no other reason at all. See you out there! I will gladly beat Kevin Owens again. I need to whip his ass again anyway. That motherfucker gonna fucking attack me after I beat him fair and square in the last episode. He st he ca he stole cold stuttered me twice. Well, one was the first one was during the match, but the second one was right after after I beat him. He was being a sore loser. Ms. GM jacket, his GM pants. I don't want his fucking gear. <laughs> I don't want it. A must-see champion. All right. Hey, let's get it started, man. I will gladly be Kevin Owens again. Gladly. I need to whoop his ass again anyway. He's going to do a cheap shot on me. Other stuff. Okay, let me see if he's going to say my name repeatedly. I heard they fixed that glitch with the ring announcer. Okay, it's just Kevin Owens. Wait, is this for the title? He's not gonna say, wait, oh, this is the championship match, right? He's not gonna say my name again until I'm in the freaking ring. Yeah, he's outside the ring. Yeah, he's not going to say my name right now. Yeah, he's outside of it. Well, we already saw my entrance. Let's, let's just skip it. Skip the intro. Let's get this ass kicking. Let's get it started. Oh, K.O., you're not winning this match. Uh, I'm going you know right now. I'm with your ass. Hey, bro, I'm telling you. Oh, reversal. Oh, got you back. Drop kick. All right, look at that objective. Take the fight to K.O. Ooh, mean uppercut. Oh, I missed him. Got him. DDT. Get your ass out of here. Where's Miz at? Is he out here? Oh, oh, uh, never mind. This is shenanigan number one. After I complete this objective right here, Miz is going to come right out. Uh, I, already, I already know. All right. Wait, what? Oh, that's right. I forgot. Oh. No, I'm doing it too early. Got your ass. Got your ass. Yeah. No. No. Oh, that was too early. Oh, no. I still got to get used to that train blows thing. That's a new feature. I'm not used to it. Reversal. Got him. All right, that's complete. Uh-oh. Turn around. Oh, reversal. Surprise, Kevin Owens with a leverage pin. Oh, I got him. Let's go. Back to back. For mercy. Come on, this is unnecessary. Come on. Share to the gut. This is an all-out assault. 
Our GM Miz was the one who introduced the chair in the first place. Maybe he thought the champ needed to take a seat after a tiresome match. We don't know. So how do you explain this? Miz looks like a kid caught with his hand in the cookie jar with that table. So much for being an impartial observer. Run, Miz. Get out of there. Looks like the champion might take advantage of that table Miz set up. Another backfire for our GM. He better not go through with this. And down through the table. Yes. Kevin Owens is absolutely laid out. Miz tried to involve himself in this match and managed to hoist himself by his own petard. The WWE Universal Champion has come to SmackDown, and he's making a statement to Miz, KO, in the entire WWE Universe. Yeah, well, take a look in the Miz's eyes, Cole. That champion's going to regret this. This man Miz has no idea who he's fooling around with right now. He's trying to sabotage me. He's trying to make my life a living hell here on SmackDown. That's not going to happen. Come on now, Miz. <laughs> after assaulting Kevin Owens after the WWE Universal, Universal title match on SmackDown, Miz has promised serious consequences. Miz, get the fuck out of here, man. You just... You try to get me attacked up after the match. Like, what are you... Like, what, bro? Roman Reigns, listen to y'all talking about this chump barely winning his first defense on day one. I held the WWE Universal title for so long that I have nothing left to prove. Call me if I can make it through 30 days a month. <laughs> All right, so now what? Like, Miz, you bastard. What the hell, Miz? Impartial observer? You were passing chairs, setting up tables. I'm surprised you didn't chuck a ladder at me for good measure. Turns out the situation called for a partial observer. It's what's best for the image of the brand. And that would be Kevin Owens? What does he have that I don't? Kale's exciting, unpredictable. Yeah, he's a little rough around the edges, but Maurice has her stylist working on a makeover, and there's this amazing jacket being tailored. Look, the point is, KO has promised to be the Miz's undisputed WWE Universal Champion, and that's what matters. Believing a word KO tells you is your first mistake, and more importantly, I've beaten your poster boy. Twice now. Beaten him with a chair. Put him through a table. You mentioned a ladder earlier. Well, let's go there. At Clash at the Castle, you will put the WWE Universal title on the line against KO in a TLC match. Fine. I'm going to walk into that match with my title, and I'll walk out with it, too. No, no, no. You will not walk in with the WWE Universal title, because it will be hanging high above the ring, right where it belongs. Out of your reach. Well, I'm going to end it off right here. Next episode, we're going to start off with the TLC match for the WWE Universal Undisputed Championship. Did I just say that backwards? WWE. Okay, I did. The WWE Undisputed Universal Championship. <laughs> okay, so that's, that's what we're going to start off at. Thanks for watching the video. I'm going to catch you in the next one. I'm out. We're going to whip KO's ass for the third time. I promise you.